All right. Good morning, Mass Bomb staff and students. This is Mr. Lon with your Monday D Day announcements, upcoming events. Today, 10th grade students at 1.45 p.m., we have a 10th grade town hall. Mr. Douglas and Mr. Lamumba will be leading that. An announcement will be made. Just an FYI to everyone, 10th grade town hall. Friday, March the 3rd, that's this Friday, we have a student half day. And also on that day, students, we have the final accounting and celebration for students that achieve 90% or better attendance this month. We have the 90% or better attendance dance. Yes. And students, as you know, our number one priority as educators at MassBomb, always to keep you safe and healthy so that you can learn. That means reach out to a staff member that you trust if you have concerns or problems because we are here to support you. All right. I want to congratulate the class officers of 2024 who are now officially named. Congratulations to the following 11th grade students who were elected to represent the class of 2024 as class officers. For president, we have Serenity McClendon for Vice President. We have Natalyn Dennis for Secretary. We have Antoinette smith Bethia, And for Treasurers, we have Larissa Duzabel and Rosabelle Lazaro de Rosa. Hey, ladies. <laughs> Great job by all of you. You are all leaders. I am all just, I'm, I'm so happy to see this list of names and knowing you all since you were ninth graders here at Mass Bomb, actually, I think Natalie and you start in 10th grade, but the rest of you starting in ninth grade, uh, great job, everyone. Great job with growing, great job with developing as leaders. The future is very bright for the class of 2024. Congratulations. All right, this is courtesy of Coach Calamag. Spring sports begin Monday, March the 6th. We are still looking for students to participate in boys baseball, girls softball, boys volleyball, and co-ed track. All student athletes need a PIAA physical on file to participate in spring sports. City Life is providing free physicals for all district students if you need one. You just need to bring your student district ID to a City Life clinic. It's that easy. And if you need a new ID, you just got to go see Mr. Trainer on your lunch period. Appointments are highly preferred, but walk-ins are also welcome. For City Life location, see the link. Uh, it's at www.citylifehealth.com backslash locations backslash. Reminder about Cooth being a free resource, free con confidential mental health and well-being resource for students. You can access it through those links there. In the way of clubs, we have meeting today. We have the Spanish Media and Translation Club with Mr. King every Monday from 2.45 to 3.45. That's in room 605. We have the Tabletops <coughs> Games Club with Mr. Thomas in room 407. We have the Gamers Club with Mr. Lamumba in 3.23. After school, we have the Rubik's Cube Club with... Miss Walker daily from 7 to 7.30 a.m. We are finishing out CTE month. Had a lot of great events for CTE month. We had the CTE fair. We had Mr. Blocker being recognized as teacher of the month. We did our shop selection this month. It's been a great CTE month. We have our 90% or better Attendance Initiative, our dance on March the 3rd. Okay, more information will be coming out, students, about that in the next day or two, coming days. Yes, that is my beagle crying in the background. Um, she's happy to see somebody that just walked in the door. All right, back to the announcements. Bracelet sale, uh, Chromebook repairs, social media. Okay, we're actually up to, I believe it's, I'll uh, make a real-time edit there. 1235 Instagram followers. We've grown quite a bit. I remember, I remember when we first started this, like really pushing our Instagram 
I guess three years ago or so, we were like in the hundreds, just like in the 100s. So we've grown quite a bit, getting the word out about Mass Bomb and all the great things that are happening, staff and student events alike. The staff and student shout outs. I want to shout out 11th grade student, class of 2024 student, Wayne Tool for repping his shop. See, here's the context. Here's the background. We all know Mr. Blocker, one teacher of the month for month of February is a great day for Team Mass Bomb. Dr. Watlington visited. He saw some great things in her school, got to celebrate Mr. Blocker. So we celebrated the event and Mr. Blocker on Instagram. And then Wayne starts sliding in the Instagram comments saying, Chef Tim should have won instead. And there is one school of thought that would say, you know, Wayne, stop being a hater. But there's another school of thought that says, Wayne is just proud of his shop. And Wayne, that's the school of thought that I fall in, and I think pretty much all of us fall in. You know, we're proud of all our shop teachers, all our teachers, period, at Mass Bomb. But Wayne, I like the pride that you were showing in Chef Tim and Culinary. National Days. Today is National Retro Day. Shout out to those of you that have just been rocking the same styles for the past 20, 30, 40 years. And, you know, you're not doing it to be ironic or retro or anything. But, you know, you're, you know today's your day. That's that today. That would be National Retro Keeping It Real Day. Also, it's National Polar Bear Day. It's kind of strange that polar bears get their own national day, but why not? I like polar bear. Polar bear is a tolerable animal. Dangerous from what I've heard, but I don't ever expect to encounter a polar bear, so I'll just celebrate polar bears today. Hey, we're Mass Bomb. We build the future. Have a great Monday.